Well, hello, my friends. I'm running a few minutes behind today because I'm in a different time zone and I forgot about it. <laughs> but anyway, I'm so glad that you uh, have joined us today. And uh, a number of years ago, I had a, a, a friend say, what's the latest book that you've read? Now, I knew what he was talking about. I realized that it's important to read and a lot of people have a lot of good things to say uh, that we could use. But, but my favorite book, and, I, and this, is, this was the way I responded basically in my mind. I said, you know what? The favorite book I've read is the Bible. I love the Bible. I love reading the Bible. I like to hear what other people say. And uh, like I said, I think it's important to, to draw from what others say. But more importantly, and most importantly, is the Word of God. I just love consuming God's Word. And so uh, the Gospels, the story about Jesus, to me, it's just, it, 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 there's no greater story than, than the story about Jesus and His work uh, when He came and all the things that He did. But I began to analyze, and I think we could sum up the gospel in three words. Three words. We could just sum up the, the, the four gospels, the good news, in three words. And today I want to talk about the first one of those words. It's the word come. And I go to the, uh, Matthew chapter number 11, verse number 28, 29, and 30. It says this, Come to me, all who are laboring are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and lowly in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Jesus says, come to me. Those that are having difficulties, those that are having problems, those that need rest. I tell you, we're in a busy world. We're in a, we're in a, uh, there's so many things and obstacles that could drain our energy. And Jesus simply says, come. If we will come to him, my friends, he's calling the Christian to come. Those, because, you know, we get so busy sometimes that, that we, we wear out. We get tired. He says, come to me. I'll give you rest. Let me tear, carry your burden. He's calling the sinner to come. I can tell you the wages of sin is death and it's heavy. It's like carrying a heavy load around when, when, when we have sin in our heart and so if you're watching and there's sin in your life and you just don't know which way to turn, and I'm just telling you, come to Jesus. Come. I believe in the Word of God throughout the Gospels, Jesus was asking people to come, come to Him. But not just then. He's calling us to come today. And so my friends, you know, it's, uh, it's amazing where uh, you know, credit cards and bankers and all, the, they're saying, come come to me or come to our business so that we can help you. There's a lot of people calling or trying to get our attention to come. But Jesus, if we will come to Jesus, he truly is the one that will give us rest, give us peace, give us strength, whatever it is we need. If we'll just come to him, he has it. So today, my friends, come to Jesus. God bless you. Look forward to seeing you tomorrow. We'll give you the second word in, in the nutshell of the gospel. God bless. Bye-bye.